of Olivia. What? What are you going to be doing for Halloween? Halloween's not till the end of next month. I know. But it'll be here before you know it. Do you have any plans? Um, yeah. My friends and I are going to go to the woods and tell scary stories. You're going to go to the woods? Yeah. It'll be fun. Does mom know you're doing this? Yeah. She does. Why well, was there a pause between yeah and she does? That's how I always talk. Whatever. So what are you doing on Halloween? Nothing. Mom's going to a costume party at her work, so I'm stuck on candy duty. Somebody's got to get a little darlings. Girls, I know it's Saturday night, but it's almost midnight. You gotta get some sleep. Okay, Mom. Go to sleep. Okay. And, um... Girls, I need to know what you got, your guys' plans are. Mom, you know what my plans are. I'm giving candy out. I know. I just like to tease you. I know. You do whatever you hear. What about you, Olivia? I'm going to find out which one of us is adopted. I'm sorry. Look, I'm, I'm going to... Me and my friends are going to go to the woods and tell scary stories. Is that okay? We're going to have like a sleepover. My friend lives across the street from the cemetery. The cemetery. Yeah. I'll have to think about it. You guys go to sleep now. Good night. Good night, Mom. Good night, Mom. Turn off the lights. Kinda I'm trying to sleep. Please talk to me. What's wrong? Do you think it's a good idea for me to have a sleepover? Now that I actually said it to mom, it didn't seem so secret anymore. Were you planning on keeping it a secret? Cause if you were, you didn't do a very good job. My friend Madison told me about this, this story about her cemetery. Which cemetery does your friend live across the street from? The one down on South Ave. Oh, well, I heard about that place. Why are you looking at me like that? I hear that there was a guy Dressed as a bear who always chased people on Halloween. Yeah, okay, whatever. I'm serious. Whoever walked in that cemetery on Halloween, the bear would take them, and chew them up, chop them up, and eat them. That's disgusting. You're just trying to scare me. No, I'm not. I had a friend named Emma, who went in the cemetery during the night. Who's Emma, exactly? You're scaring me. Good, that was my intention. It's just a story, okay? No such thing as a giant bear man. Just go to bed. This is so much fun, Madison. I know, isn't it? It's so cool. Yeah. You know, you wanna hear what my foster sister said to me? What? She agreed with the story you told me about the bear. I was just kidding. My sister said it was real. Come on. Your sister's just trying to scare you. 
Yeah, maybe I'm right. Maybe I'm worrying for nothing. Yeah, it could be. What was that sound? Probably just the wind. Come on. Let's kind of Halloween candy. Where'd that breeze come from? I don't know. What are you guys doing? <gasps> it's the bell! Oh, come on. He's clearly a guy in a costume. Come on. Damn, this mask is on so tight. I'm not a guy in a costume. You're coming with me. Madison! Get help, Olivia! Get help! I can't move! I can't move! Oh! No! 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 This is a bad dream. McKenna! McKenna! What? It's three in the morning. What are you doing? McKenna, I had a really bad nightmare. I dreamt about that guy in the bear costume that you told me about. And he took Madison. And then he was going to take me. It was just a dream, Olivia. Go back to bed. <sighs> Thanks for the help, sis. Hmm, 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 hmm.